Welcome back guys. It's been a long, long time since you guys see me. Uh, new job, yada yada, I'll get all that. But look at this, all this beauty of fall. Yeah, I don't like it that much because I get leaves all over my car. My car is filthy. Take you out today with me because Jessica's out on the town. Uh, I'm heading to the shooting range right now. I'm gonna make a few stops. I'm gonna carry you guys along with me because I have nothing else better to do, so. Alright guys, so that's over. I am done with shooting right now. Heading to Best Buy. I want to go to Best Buy and check out if they have the A7 III. Uh, maybe the A7 III. I'm not getting the AR3 or 7 III, whatever it's called. Not paying three grand for a camera. So let's go check it out, see if they got it. Um, Here's the Canon R camera. I think it's pretty cool. I mean, for that price, that's ridiculous. That's a ridiculous price for a camera. Uh, I don't think I'll ever buy this, because I, I noticed the lens is actually 3,000 itself. So it's an on button. It's, it's pretty cool. Oh, look at it. Way too much. I mean, you might as well get a 5D Mark IV for that price. So guys, uh, I looked at the A7 III. I couldn't talk while I'm in the store. I could've talked, but this guy was just staring at me the entire time, so I just put a, you know, flash up. But the Canon R, Canon R actually looks better in person than it does online. It feels great in the hands, it's a nice size. But for almost $4,000, no. Uh, I wish Canon would at least be competitive because I am a Canon fan. But I think I'm gonna have to switch to Sony. I wanted to wait to Canon gets a new camera and I knew they were coming with something, but they did and they failed terribly. Uh, I'm not gonna spend an extra thousand dollars on a camera with like six more megapixels with, you know, I don't, I'm done with that. So I'm gonna go with the Sony. Just gotta convince Jessica that it's a good idea to get the Sony. I think I can pull it off. So I had to stop by the mall because I had to stop by the mall because I remember to have a stain on my shoe here. Let's see, it's right there in the corner. And I couldn't find anything to clean it off, and I'm not as a sneakerhead as I used to be. Uh, so I didn't protect it like a dummy. Oh, I'm zooming in. Oh, how do I? See, I didn't protect it like I was supposed to. So I'm gonna go in the mall and see if they have something to clean these shoes with because I am very disappointed that I spent all this money in shoes and got a little, didn't even bother to buy anything to clean it. And some protectant, and I have to do it for my Yeezys because I haven't worn those yet and I'm afraid to wear them because they're all white. And I have to protect those as well. So let's run in here and see what they got. So guys, I picked up the Crep Cure. Cure and the crap uh, ultimate rain and stain remover or protector. And this is the shoe in question at the moment. You see that ugly brown mark on it? Hopefully, I can clean it off. I don't know what the hell I wasted on that. So, we're gonna try and see if this works. What you guys think? I don't know, I think it's coming off. Some on the side too. So let's just try to get that as well. Looks like I'm doing this wrong. Let's get a warm bowl of water. Now, let's get the warm bowl of water, see if it makes a difference. 
So I have the warm water now. So let's try this. Warm water. Oh shit. Dab, dab, dab. And as you can see, I'm using a lot of this because I'm hopefully I don't have to use this all the time. The protectant works. So we're gonna. Looks clean. Looks like it is off. I need to see where it's at because this side is damp, but I don't think it's going. Alright. So I haven't worn these yet. And I heard they need protection. And as you can tell, they're all white, so it's impossible to keep these clean unless you have some kind of protector on it. And I heard check check crap. Crip is a pretty good protective, but I also heard people have problems with changing the color of the shoes. God, I hope that doesn't happen right now. <laughs> but I don't think it should. So, shoes clean, shake it. Wait 10 minutes, spray it again. Wait 10 minutes, and that's it. So, clean, shake, eight inches away. 10 minutes. All right, so, here we go. So the shoe is clean, so they need to do all that. So let's get a good note. Then get the other one. So, uh, I waited the uh, 20 minutes in between sprays and I think it's cured. Let's see, we're gonna do a, we're gonna do a test. We're gonna do a water test first. Let's see what the water does. Oh man, that's pretty cool. All right, we can do the, we can do a little skip. All right, I really, really hope this works. I hope this works, because if it doesn't, I'm gonna be pissed. So I have this in the cup. I'm gonna try and <laughs> see what happens. Oh shit. Oh, I caught some. Had to get that out of there. <sighs> well, in case that didn't work. guys check <clears throat> crap I keep calling you check for some reason I don't know you messed me up man I uh almost messed my damn shoes up like seriously what's up with that man did not I, I covered the whole shoe in your crap Maybe I should let it wait longer, but this is gonna be the end of the day, guys. You almost got me, Chick. You almost got me. But good thing I didn't pour a lot. Pour a little bit, got it off. Won't be able to resell these. So uh, this is gonna be the end of my video. I'm kind of disappointed. I'm not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. But uh, see you guys later. Make sure you like and subscribe. It's Subscribe to the channel, got some more things on the way. But until next time guys, have a good day.